Well, Judd, that was mighty impressive. Uh, three centuries in the first six frames, two in the first three. I know you'll pick holes in the in that performance, but uh, you know, a, an amazing score sheet for you. Yeah, I started off well, which gave me a lot of confidence. I think um, a little bit of bad run. I think I was on for a, a good break at one point to go four one up. Uh, I had a kick there. Other than that, I missed the odd ball, but it was pretty solid to start the season. Yeah, I had to feel for Jordan because he held himself together well on a couple of occasions. Two really nice 65 breaks from him and he'll, he'll come away disheartened somehow from that match. Yeah, he didn't do a lot wrong really. I think um, you'll have to take the positives really. I think uh, every time I got in I scored pretty heavy. So he dug in, um, which didn't surprise me. I think he's improved a lot over the past couple of seasons. It looks like he practices hard with, with Mark Allen um, and he's still got a lot of potential I think. People who sort of only see you through Instagram will kind of have thought that you've taken a few months off after the World Championship, but you know, you're, you're not kind of kidding them really, it's, uh, or rather you are kidding them because you've been on the practice table for the last month, haven't you? Yeah, I've been practicing for the last month. Obviously, I, I don't really show that side as much. I kind of show the other side. Um, so some people think I'm not practicing very hard, but um, since I've had my brother up for the last nearly a year now, I think I've practiced harder than ever. And for the last month, I've dedicated myself in... Um, any time I, I come to nowadays, I'm prepared to win. Jack's getting some real opportunities to travel the world now, isn't he? Yeah, yeah, he's, he's enjoying it. So he's seeing some new places. Um, excited for Shanghai next month, his first time there. So I think that's one of the tournaments I really enjoy in China. Since you've completed the Triple Crown, do you feel like you can relax a little bit more out there and just really enjoy your snooker as usual? We, we saw some incredible shots out there today. Yeah, there is um, sort of a big weight lifted off my shoulders now. I, I can sort of feel it out there. It's nice to walk around as world champion as well, that's a, that's a good feeling for me and um, it's important for me I think to do well this season. A couple of people in the past have won the world and had a bad season after so it's important to try and get off to a good start and get that confidence back. I guess the doors opening for that world number one spot, that would be a really nice thing to achieve this season. Yeah, after my season last year I put myself in a good position, I'm not going to go and chase it and play in every event but it's sunk in the back of my mind that obviously I want to get back to world number one. and. Um, Last time I held it for about five or six weeks, so it would be nice to hold it um, for as long as Mark Selby did. Well, good luck this week, Judd. Cheers.